स्वागत छ दर्शक वृन्दहरुलाई यस घडीमा यतिखेर हामी यो नेपाल हाम्रो देश निकै नै जर्जर अवस्थाबाट अगाडि बढिरहेको छ यसको लागि विभिन्न देशबाट विभिन्न ठाउँबाट यतिबेला नेपालमा आइरहनु भएको छ विभिन्न देशका व्यक्तिहरु आइरहनु भएको छ रेस्क्यू फोर्सहरु आइरहेको छ र नेपाललाई मदत गर्ने प्रयास नेपाललाई चाहिँ एउटा सहयोगी हातहरु अगाडि बढाउने प्रयासहरु भइरहेको छ यो सिलसिलामा हाम्रो नेपालमा यतिबेला इन्डियाबाट पनि थुप्रै Force रो आए कासन नेपाल मा rescue को लागे रतेस मध्य बाटा national disaster response force बाटा हमी संग यदि बेला chief उन्होंने O P Singh हमी वहाँ संग की कुराकानी करना गई रहेगा सो स्वागत है यहाँ welcome to Nepal thank you tell us something about the rescue work how it's been going ever since earthquake struck Nepal we were the first country to reach here and within six hours our seven teams arrived in Kathmandu and immediately we got a briefing from the Nepal army and they directed us to go to all these places where the, the, the maximum impact was there and we got scattered for by the by the seven teams to various places and on the very first day we started our operations and we recovered seven live uh, uh, victims from the debris and in total we have already saved 11 people 11 live victims from different parts of the country Apart from that, we have also retrieved 130 dead bodies and we are still continuing with the search and rescue operations and we are trying to help the people of Nepal and we are trying to assist the Nepal government and Nepal people by our search and rescue operations. Are you feeling any kind of the difficulties till now? The initial difficulties were there because we were experiencing fresh tremors of uh, earthquake and after that we had some rains also that hampered some of the activities of our operations but now it's all comfortable and we are conducting our operations in a very professional and efficient manner how long you are going to stay over here for the rescue purpose we will be here for quite some time as long as the nepal government wants us because we are still con conducting our operations in other parts of the Kathmandu yeah. valley it's been uh, eight days that earthquake came to nepal and uh, how do you analyze this situation there has been a massive damage and you know the extent of uh, damage as well as the number of people killed. Thousands and thousands of people have been killed because of this earthquake. So we all feel very sorry for this, uh, for the people of Nepal as well as for the country of Nepal. And I think uh, it will take some years, it will take some time for Nepal to, uh, to rehabilitate its people as well as to recover. So uh, Nepal is getting assistance from all over the world, including India. Our Prime Minister was very forthcoming. In fact, uh, uh, right from the day one, he has been in touch with the Nepali people. Yesterday, our National Security Advisor came and visited the uh, area and met the political leaders here. So I'm sure the Nepal government will do all, all, all from its capabilities to bounce back. Did you uh, meet with some political, high-level political meetings? Any? No, I did not meet, but I had a meeting with the Nepal Army Chief. Uh, what was their response or what was their verdict on this and how Nepal Army is working uh, to bounce back? We are in close cooperation with the Nepal Army. In fact, we are assisting Nepal Army and Nepal people. And it's a joint effort by the Nepal Army as well as the National Disaster Response Force from India. So we are all one in, in, in helping the people out here. What will be your support in the coming days? We, we are supporting in our relief work, we are supporting in our rescue work and we'll continue to do so as long as the people of Nepal want it. Okay. Uh, so, tell us something, how can Nepal bounce back? How can Nepal come back with the plans of development and all? I think they'll have to do some introspections. They'll have to sit together and work out a plan of action because this is a gigantic task and Nepal has to work on it, has to deliberate upon it, and I'm sure Nepal will do that. There is one blame to India that India in the name of rescue work is rescuing just the Indian citizen, is taking back the Indian citizen from Nepal. Is that true or not? No, Nepal has been right from the beginning. Nepal has been uh, involved in the rescue work. And our seven teams immediately came and right now we are the largest contingent. We have 16 teams comprising almost more than 700 people working different locations for rescue works. In the process, yes, we did evacuate our Indian citizens, but at the same time, we did not lag behind in the rescue works. And that is why you would recall that out of the 15 live uh, victims uh, who have been taken out, 
14, 11 have been taken out by the Indian contingent, by the Indian rescue team. And this couldn't have been possible without the cooperation of the Nepal army. What about, uh, are you planning to go to outside uh, Kathmandu or you have gone there uh, for the rescue? The relief work has also, all, uh, relief work has been done there outside the Kathmandu Valley. But if the Nepal government wants, we can go anywhere within the country. Thank you so much. Dashwin, the one OP Singh, the Chief National Disaster Response Force India, the Chief OP Singh, the Ramir Mahasanga, Nepal Makosari, the Yobukampa, the rescue of Kamaru, the Tatarat, the Kadir Kosari, the Gadi Bodhi Rai Kosari, the Bishai Mahajan Kari, the Sriami, the Niranda Rupam, the Kampa Kubare Mahami, the Object Rupani, the Dijani Song, the Bivina Bikti Toru Sanga, the Kurakani Pani Gorni Song, the Kosari, the Nepal Ma, the Udhara Rupai Rai Kosari, the Sriami, 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 the Sriami